We are also requesting as number four for the development of cultural sites, ecotourism. Eco eco Here we have Kanai bankers where King Kabulega and, and, and Mwana were arrested. We also have Otoka Gateway, where the three clans of Lao entered Lao from, established a rehabilitation home in Lao. There are issues about street children. If we can have these street children settled and at the same time trained, we appreciate for the hub at Lira University. Obviously, it's helping our people, but it's not yet enough. We need to take care of these other street children also. But from Lira University, there was a promise for the construction of the industrial roads, the connection roads within the university. This is a reminder just that if it's followed, it will be good for us. I have other things that were not completed, which I'm not going to mention them one by one. We talked about road infrastructure, uh, some of which are not yet uh, being implemented. And we are praying that uh, you uh, maybe take note of that. Then in the area of electricity, we want to say thank you. However, we have noticed uh, some uh, discouragement in the distribution of electricity in Lira City, whereby power is very unreliable and is affecting investors and um, some of the industry which are being put up. So please, we talked about that and we just give you um, the feedback that this is yet to be helped. I'm glad about the idea of a ranch. So I will tell our people to start supporting that ranch. Now, I will get uh, under the equipment, that the, the ranch needs the equipment and all that, but also the cows. You need both equipment and cows. I'm glad the chiefdom wants to do institutional farming. That's why we're asking for 11 tractors and an earth moving equipment, equipment. That's a very good idea. I, of course, these pledges, I may not have all the resources to implement them, but I will see what I can do. But, but, but this, is, this is a good idea. It is, it is in the right direction. I'm very glad to hear our people in the north speaking of coffee, speaking of cocoa, speaking of avocado, of course, you know, I have always been encouraging you about the fruits also. Uh, but you should also add dairy farming and fish farming. So I'm very glad to hear people talk, because this is where the uh, part of the poverty in northern Uganda comes from. The seasonal crops are good, but they are a bit erratic. One year they are all right, another year, they, but this, the perennial crops, they give you like a stable base. Yeah. You have this this year and this year, and even if the price goes down, it can't go down so much that you you fail to, to, to get some income. So, and, there, and some of these areas have got enough rain to grow the, the, the coffee, to grow the, the, these uh, crops which need the, uh, good rainfall. So I'm very happy with that, uh, that awakening, awakening of our people here. Human life, rape and murdering Karamojong, cattle rustlers and displacing, uprooting and dis elders of Karamoja there. Meeting number two will be in Lao. It's actually stopped and we continue as brothers and sisters. 2020, then there is another meeting which was, if it was not possible, you'd give them some irons. Have not been done. What has actually happened? Is <laughs> big story here is that in that meeting in Baralegi to the to the to to, to the RDC's government, 
And he himself goes ahead to say you support him. Right. Order number 29, Day of Al Foundation 2003. That document is there. I'd like to end by saying, long live the president, long live NRM government. Well, it's about health. Your Excellency has the need at the moment. We, we, for the 